Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mike835 again, bringing you another G-Shock review and unboxing. If you guys didn't check out my last G-Shock review and unboxing, which I just did, this is the second uh, review that I'm doing tonight. I actually picked up uh, a GLS 5500MM, which is the pink M&M series. You know, mainly everybody knows the blue one and the orange one. But if you did miss that video, go on my channel and check it out. This is my uh, second uh, pickup, which I picked up today after work. Anyways, I would like to introduce to you to this awesome G-Shock that I just picked up. It's a model that uh, you don't see too often anymore. I'm going to explain to you why in a minute. As you see here, uh, the watch is Tough Solar, and it is a multiband 6, as you see here in my video. Multiband 6 and Tough Solar with the orangey uh, button, as you see here. I love the solar and atomic watches. It's not your razzle dazzle, you know, it's not your collaboration, but it's, you know, very functional. This uh, watch has different modes, as you see here mode, world time, alarm, stopwatch, timer, and if you press here on this button on solar atomic models on the right hand side, it's going to tell you the last time it synced up, which was uh, month four, day five. They really had some bad reception where this watch was sitting at. Wow, that was a long time ago. So it goes to show you how long it was, uh, how long it's been there, and nobody's picked it up. Fortunate for me, I've been watching for this watch for a couple months, but uh, my guy definitely gave me a price that I had to go home with me this time. And this is, um, you see this watch to the left? This is my daily wear, as you see here. Multiband 6, Tough Solar, you guys are going to say, hey, it looks similar. Uh, yes, uh, it looks to be the same color of bezel, the button is different, but function-wise, it's the same watch, but this one right here, check this out, guys, how cool. It has a metal bracelet, metal composite, like they call it. Of course, this is brand new in box, uh, G-Shock, as you see here. I had it fitted to my size. You know, my dude did it for free, so they did take away two links on this particular watch. I do have them, so pretty cool. If one day I decide, uh, you know, to get rid of it, I uh, guess the new owner will have the links and it's not a problem. They're, you know, they're held together with pins, so it's not a big deal. You know, anybody with basic tools can get it done. But, you know, I really love the quality of this G-Shock. It's just... It's a fancy G-Shock. Check this out, guys. The model number is the GW6900BC, which is probably uh, bracelet, means bracelet composite. As you see here, G-Shock. A watch that seldom pops up, and I just had to have it. I mean, it's, it's your fancy. If you're going to go out with the G-Shock and wear a suit, I'd be rocking this one right here, guys. Check this out. Awesome. Might as well. I never do too many wrist shots, but the watch is brand new. It's just not going to hurt it for me to put it on. So check this out, guys. I'll put it on for you guys. Mike835 is going to do a wrist shot. Oh, whoa. No way. There it is, guys. Tell me how it looks. Wrist shot. My wrist uh, is about 7 inches. So if you guys want to get an idea what it may look like, it's brand new. I think it looks great. It's a great stealthy look. Really happy to find it. Um, great price. Watch, um, not too common. I think if you go on eBay right now, it's maybe like $300. Yeah, it's a serious coin for it. I love the composite metal bracelet. It feels so great. And you know, it doesn't feel too heavy, but substantial. A little, you know, it's not as heavy as a frog. But overall, wow, man, I'm really impressed. I really like it. One of those that it's not your fancy one. It's not a collaboration. It's not, you know, it's not breezy color. But if you're a G-Shock lover, you guys, you guys will appreciate this and how it looks. I love the composite bracelet. I'm going to zoom in so you guys can see the watch more in detail and how this the composite bracelet look like up close and personal. I 
I know you guys have fancy G-Shocks, but you got one of these? You got one of these? <laughs> oh, yeah. I got the Rolex of G-Shocks right here. What's up? I guess uh, you guys with the $1,700 Frogman. I know you guys, uh, the series collectors got them. Yeah. Your Frogman is $1,700, but do you have a composite bracelet? Guess not. I think you just have a... What is it? A resin? Resin? <laughs> Anyways, guys. I want to thank you guys for watching all my videos and participating. I really do. Uh, I really, uh, I mean it honestly. So, if you did enjoy my video, I'm always, uh, you know, I'm always putting new commentary up, new videos. I'm always participating in all the G-Shock society. So, please, uh, if you did enjoy my video, uh, please do me a favor and rate, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all you guys' feedback. And uh, if you ever have any questions about G-Shocks, don't be shy. I don't bite. Not yet. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, ask me any question. Um, I'll be more than happy to help you guys out. Thanks for watching. It's Mike835 again. I got my Rolex of G-Shock in my hands. What's up, guys? You got to get this one. Rolex of G, Mike835, signing out.